My name is Nelly Kalumbi. I'm 15 years old. I learn at Stella Maris Secondary School and I'm in Form 3 South. Uh, I like dancing, singing, uh, and chatting with friends and making new friends. Uh, when I grow up, I would like to be a nurse so that I can help the sick people and save people's lives. Uh, I like Malawi because it is a country that teaches good morals and has good cultures. Uh, My name is Clara Lewis. I came from Mulanje and I'm from 3 East. I came as the Amalis in 2010. When I came here, it was uh, it was like a dream. I didn't believe that I'll be here and I was happy. And uh, the, sele the selection here are always high. And I believe that one day I'll go to college and I want to be a doctor to save men's lives. Yeah. Um, my name is Mary Tsoa. I came from Chihuahua district in Gab, DA Gab. And I like reading news, newspapers and watching TV and also playing football. And I, I, I learned at Stella Maris in from, I'm from Flea, South East. And when I grow up, I want to be a doctor because I want to make to save other people's so. What I like most, I like dancing, singing, playing netball, and I like netball so much. Yeah. yeah, I live with my dad, and my dad doesn't work, and he can't afford to pay my school fees, Probably, yeah, and that is why I need help, yeah, so that one day I can be someone in the future, yeah. I have a single parent who is a mother, and she's, she's a businesswoman. We have six in our family, one girl and five boys. So I need, I need the help so that I can, my, my future should be, should be bright yeah uh, I came from in my parents home my parents and one parents is have she had he works and I want I would like help from you and so that in future I can make it what I want My name is Chegondi Ganjata. I come from Ncheo, in Ncheo, Gumbi village, Tia Kwatayi. I'm 16 years old. I, we're four in our family. I'm the last born. Um, I, when I grow up, I want to be a doctor because I, I think that's my calling, to be a doctor. And um, uh, what I love about my school is that it's it's all about education, academics. Yeah, we, there is less entertainment. So, yeah, I think I'm gonna achieve my goals because of that. My name is Christina Sawerusika. I came from Mulanje district in Chilingulo village. We are five in our family, and I'm the firstborn. And I like Malawi because it's a peaceful country. 
a good vegetation and good climate in its tradition dances. Yeah. My education, my ambition, I want to be a nurse when I grow up. And I would like those people who want to help me so that I can continue with my education because sometimes I face so many problems with paying my school fees. My parents are not employed. There are so many difficulties. Yeah. I'm Eunice Nchenga from Chukwa District, TN Kabo, Sauber Bridge. We are six in our family. I'm the second poem. My I live with my grandparents. My parents died when I was in standard three. And my grand my grandparents are peasant farmers since they 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 have a small land. And I like learning and praying medible. I like Malawi since it has a good vegetation and have game resources where I can watch some animals. I'm Tauzan Mbea from Chiri Mbarati in Brenta. Um, uh, at home, we are seven of us, and I'm the third one. Since selected right here, I've been facing problems in paying school fees. This my, my dad is just a temporary farm. That we depend much on them. Yeah, I like I like Malawi just because of its climate and this school has all trained teachers. That's all. Yeah, I like Malawi because it has it is a piece of country. And my grandparents have difficulties to find school fees for me since they are not employed. Yeah, I like playing native ball running and also joking with my friends yeah <laughs> i love reading novels and singing um the reason why people are in scotland should help me is because my father is just a small scale farmer so we do, the whole family depends on that My name is Elizabeth Bandawe. I'm here at the Amani Secondary School helping these two girls, Bridget Pilos and Bese Somanji. They are deaf learners. I help them with the sign language. That's her name, Bridget. There are three in their family. There are two girls and one boy. She's in form one. Both parents, are, she's an orphan. She don't have both parents. Her sister is employed, but she earns very little money to support the two of them because both. He, he, her sister and herself, they are all in art secondary school. So they don't have, wish, the sister don't have enough money to pay for their school fees, since they are all orphans.
<laughs> After school, she wants to be a tailor. <laughs> And that's her name, she's Bessie. She's in Form 1. She's coming from Chilazro district. She's coming from a family of seven children. There are three sisters and two boys. <laughs> she, want, she, want, she, she likes computers, so she wants to work as a as a secretary. <laughs> My name is Tracy Graciano. I'm coming from Cho. T.A. Bumbe. When I, when I grow up, I want to be an accountant. <laughs> My name is Abuzigan Zimala. I come from Mangoji. I am, I am 16 years old. I'm from one. In my future, I want to I want to be a judge. My name is Faith Chakanza. I come from Germany in Atlanta. I am 12 years old and I'm in Form 1. I want, when I grow up, I want to be a university doctor so that I can help those who are, who are paralyzed or something like that. And I, I would like to have, to have a sponsor because I would like to have a sponsor because I, I want to help some, some, some orphans in secondary schools when I grow up. And I also, I also want to help some of my relatives in, in their education. Uh, we are two in our family. And the other one is, is in like primary school. My name is Joseph Sola. I'm 17 years old. I am in country in our family. We have, we have four children, and I am the first one at secondary school. And when I grow up, I want to be a doctor so that I can heal some other people who are sick in different places. I'm Sister Catherine Shikadza, the head teacher of Stiramari Secondary School, and uh, I've been here now for seven months, and uh, uh, we have about 560 pupils, and these girls are coming from different districts, being a national secondary school. They are selected by the government and half by the church. Now, as they come here, it is their opportunity to develop themselves for their future life. But the challenge that we are meeting is uh, these pupils, since they are coming from different districts, from different places, we encounter also girls that are very poor, but they have that potential to perform at a secondary school. As a national secondary school, they, they are, yeah, it's a chance for them to develop their life. So we meet the challenge as a school because whatever we are learning for the school, we talk of their food in the boarding, we talk of electricity, water, salaries for the workers, we talk of uh, stationery. It's all budgeted from the fees. Now, if they are not paying, we have that hiccup of not meeting the requirements that we are supposed to care for them. So we are trying to, to ask uh, different people
who can intervene to uplift the life of these girls. But generally, the girls who are selected to a national secondary schools, it means they have that potential to perform in society. And we know if you, do, if you educate a girl, you educate the nation. And uh, since nationwide, girls, most of the girls, they don't have much chance of studying compared to boys. So it's a pity for us to send a girl back home because of fees. That's why we are coming for uh, assistance from different people. Thank you. <laughs>